Hey guys, welcome to your general reading for Virgo. This is going to be for your August 2023. You can apply this to any of your placements because anything could come up. So uh, we are going to take a look at what your shadow work is, your shadow side is for August. Uh, so for those of you guys that don't know what that is, uh, basically it's getting in touch with a part of ourselves that we repress. This is our dark side. We all have it. A part of our healing, personal growth, and spiritual growth is getting in touch with that. Uh, we're going to see what that is. And then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situation. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. Ooh, if this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Virgo people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok and also on Instagram, the links for those are in the description box below. I do post readings on there too, okay? So, Virgo. Tell me about Virgo here. Tell me about Virgo and their shadow work, their shadow side here for August 2023 for Virgo. For Virgo. One more. Okie dokie. Tell me about Virgo. We have temperance here, Sagittarius energy. I, I heard learn to forgive yourself. Yeah, someone here needs to learn to forgive themselves here, okay? So that you can find peace or that you can find peace within yourself here. King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. There you are. The Hierophant here and the Four of Pentacles. Yeah, I feel like someone here needs to learn to forgive themselves for, you know, the experience. So, uh, uh, you know, learn to forgive yourself for the mistakes that you've made. Learn to forgive yourself for, you know, for getting caught up or dealing with people that uh, were horrible to you. Um, yeah, I just feel like there's a sense of, you know, like not letting go or holding on because of that. Let's see. So, oh, seven of swords here and the five of pentacles. I do feel like somebody here has a hard time or that somebody here is having a hard time forgiving themselves because I feel like there, at some point or that there has been multiple instances where you have allowed people to take advantage of you, you know, and I feel like you're learning some big lessons or some harsh lessons here because I, I feel like it took a couple of situations to be like, okay, I got to change this. I cannot allow this to happen anymore. Okay, so let's see what else we have here. Temperance, the devil, oh, King of Pentacles, Capricorn energy with the devil here, and the death card. Someone here is having a hard time forgiving themselves for getting caught up in like very toxic situations, or that someone here is having a hard time forgiving, for, for, uh, uh, someone here is having a hard time forgiving giving themselves for get, getting caught up in like you know maybe using drugs or drinking a lot or something like that uh but there is a sense that someone here is going through like a huge re rehabilitation or something so you know when you go through that program at uh you know at like an aa meeting or something like that you go through the steps and i feel like someone here got stuck at that step of forgiveness here forgiving yourself and forgiving others here okay um uh, let's see uh death card scorpio energy yeah i feel like someone here has dealt with a drug problem here now virgo if this is not you it could be someone else but you know a lot of times when they do these types of readings this is more so for your personal growth and your spiritual growth and your healing here the uh, hierophant the king of swords leaper aquarius gemini here the four of pentacles here and the lovers here. I just feel like someone here is having has a hard time forgiving some forgiving themselves and loving themselves here. You know, some Virgos are really their harshest critic when they make a mistake. I feel like they really some some Virgos are really really just really hard on themselves. 
and you know i just feel like this is some like a shadow work that you guys need to work on here it's not an easy thing to do but you know i feel like if you keep on top of it you work on it you stay on top of it in the end i feel like it's going to be worth it uh, because i feel like if these situations were to come up again i feel like you're going to handle a lot of these situations in a much better way here right um the seven of swords page of swords five of pentacles and the six of pentacles yeah i just feel like there's a sense of not wanting to give to this anymore or that you don't want to give your power away to you know not letting go in and, 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 and holding on right so i feel like it's almost like you're reclaiming your power that you're trying to get your power back because i feel like you were giving your power away at some point so i feel like you're pulling back okay hold on one sec i think i'm going to sneeze okay no i'm not okay uh what else do we have for for virgo uh what else does virgo need to know look out for work on here for august 2023 when it comes to their shadow side their shadow work here for virgo knight of cups and knight of pentacles here meet yourself in the middle here yeah sort of like have that conversation with yourself you know yeah I, I keep hearing meet yourself in the middle here isn't that a song six of swords here in the pay, uh, queen uh, queen of swords leap aquarius gemini knight of swords here in the four of wands Maybe, I, I I do feel like there's a there there was a romantic situation that you were in that was really toxic and abusive and I feel like uh you know I do feel like someone here is having a hard time letting this go or moving on from this or like I said forgiving themselves forgiving themselves here the knight of cups with the ten of pentacles the knight of pentacles and the hermit here Virgo energy some of you guys could still be in this situation here yeah some of you guys could still be in it and it's time to distance yourself and let go of this person here because i feel like you're dealing with someone here that's all over the place the energy is like really off here you know i just feel like this is like a very toxic situation here something's wrong with my hair uh we have the six of swords here and the ace of pentacles the queen of swords and the three of wands in the reverse here I feel like someone here is having a hard time looking past or seeing like a future here for themselves. I just feel like someone here is really hard on themselves. I almost get the sense that if you're still dealing with someone here like this, that's treated you poorly, I feel like you're expecting or waiting for this person to change. But only you have that power to make that change here. And I feel like your guides and your angels and your ancestors and the universe is letting you know that you are in control here. No one else is in control. So I feel like there's a sense, like I said, of, you know, taking back your power, taking control again. Because I feel like outside forces has controlled you here. Okay? So this is about the forgiveness part. Forgiving yourself for allowing that to happen. All right, Knight of Swords here, Eight of Wands, Four of Wands here, and the uh, Hangman here, Piscean Energy. Yeah, this is about letting go, surrendering, and forgiving yourself. Because I feel like you, you are blocking yourself from your own happiness here, from your blessings here. Okay, so Virgo, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe. Hit the notification bell and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks guys. Bye.